Hey yo, it's your boy Dan Be the Goat, and today um we don't need no intro. My bad if you can't hear me all the way. But yeah, we don't need no intro. Um today's video will be how to sound like Duop King tutorial. So basically, the first thing you want to have is Apple headphones. So I know y'all like why we need Apple headphones because if you get Apple headphones, it's gonna sound exactly like him, in my opinion. When I tried it with my regular headphones, it didn't really sound like him, so I had to use Apple headphones. So yeah, um, I'm finna let y'all hear what I got, and I made the beat too, so. I got a Glock and I got a Bean, I was a business passing to the team. Niggas really, really dope fiend. I'm sipping on purple, you know what I mean. Fucking your bitch and I'm making her scream. I'm so fresh like Listerine. Go to my place and make it seem. I'm just here, y'all nigga making some dreams. All right, so a lot of y'all probably like, man, nigga, you off beat. Um, so basically, I, I, that's what I thought too when I first heard Duop King. So Duop King, he has like his own style and shit. And uh, he kind of use a like a DMV flow. If y'all don't know what a DMV flow is, look it up. You know they have a lot of videos and a lot of um songs uh, where niggas use their flows and shit like that. So yeah, um, enough about the flows. I made the beat uh, cause he his beats is kind of like you know it's it's different. And I was worried about this too, but yeah, let's go to the main vocals. So I know y'all are gonna hate me because uh, I didn't uh, edit it out, but I'm, I just put it on 25 bars. So if it does it again, it won't take that long. So yeah, this is the main vocals. I'm gonna go to the track controls. So yes, I use compressor on this. The treble is up to the right, bass is down to the left. Um, this is my own LRC5 visual EQ. So yeah, that's. That's supposed to be right here. My bad. I forgot to change it. I guess it doesn't matter, right? Because you know it still sounds the same. But yeah, um, that is a fifty-one point forty-seven hertz is in the uh, right-hand corner. If y'all can see that, it says negative five dB. So yeah, and this part. Oh shit! Make sure it's not on multiple. Yeah, um, this part. Is on negative 2.92 de decibels, and the hertz is on 150.78 hertz. So yeah, the middle, the middle, 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 middle. All right. So the decibel is the decibels. They are on 3.00. So yeah, I didn't really change that. It just stay the same. And then the hertz is on 542. 0.16 hertz so yeah and the fourth one the very important one it is on negative 3.56 decibels and the hertz is on 1511.74 hertz and you know the treble part this is treble right here the right the right is always going to be the treble the treble was on the 2.81 decibels, and the hertz is on a 4,727.94 hertz. Let me put it on Do Not Disturb. I'm sorry, that I'm saying that nigga's like, man, this nigga mad annoying. But yeah, um, the compressor, the threshold, I, I kept the same. The ratio, I, I put it on 3.2, you know. And the attack, I put it on 15.0. I just, I just left it there. I didn't really change it. The mix is all the way up. You already know that. Turn your mix all the way up on all your compressors. Just only the mix, but don't mess with the threshold like that. And let's go for the reverb. Reverb. Let me stop. My bad. I hear noise in the background. So damn. 
so yeah, this the mix is on 15, the damping is on 8.3 because you know he has a little bit, he has he has a lot of reverb on his vocals. If you listen to his songs, he has a lot of reverb. The mid time and the low time, I didn't change it. The crossover, I didn't change. The delay, I don't change. I don't change none of that unless um is a unless is a uh, specific vocal. But yeah, that's it for on the uh, zero reverb and the visual EQ. Now, the treble for the visual EQ is on 5,000 and the gain is on 12.0. And the bass on here is uh, 200 and the gain is on negative 9.5 decibels. So, yeah. And um, I'm going to let y'all hear it without the beat. I got a Glock and I got a bean. No. Off of the business, pass it to the team. Niggas really, really dope fiends. I'm just on purple, you know what I mean. Fucking your bitch and I'm making her scream. I'm so fresh like Listerine. We can go to my place and make it seem. I'm just here, y'all nigga making some dreams. I'm not posting that, by the way. But yeah, um, why my voice sounds so good? I also used the Auto Tune app. So yeah, I just, I just clicked on that. Oh yeah, make sure your noise gate is on. Make sure your noise gate is on. Um, so it can block out the noise on the um you know, vocals, so you won't hear like any sound. You still gotta be in a quiet place though. So yeah, you just go to uh, Enter App Audio, then you go to Effect, then you just go to Auto Tune Mobile. Basically, when you go to Auto Tune Mobile, I don't, I'm not going there now because I don't need it right now. But yeah, when you go to Auto Tune um Mobile, you know it's gonna have the same, you know, the same key signature. Like you just like since since it's on the E minor, all you gotta do is go to the um. I'm just show y'all. Go to auto tune mode. So yeah, um, all you gotta do is just um, my bad if you hear the popping. I usually just turn it down, but yeah, uh, I just wanna, I just wanna show y'all. So yeah, the um, key in Garage Man is the E minor, and I just turned the key on. The E minor on Auto to Mobile. So yeah, that's really all you gotta do to um, get your voice to sound like Doo-Wop Kane. And if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Um, and comment down below of what more artists that y'all want me to do. I'm sorry that um I didn't really edit this out, you know. But um next video I got y'all. I might come out with uh, another beat tutorial for y'all so y'all can get y'all beats to sound better. And um yeah, I'm out. Peace. Love y'all. Subscribe for more music content and I'm out.